Life is wild, footloose, and fancy free on the streets of Florida. And the police are hot on your heels. Hey guys, and welcome back to Transport Fever 2, a learn to play Let's Play series. We are in part two, trying to, uh, gosh, I don't know how much longer this thing is going to go. It's been kind of fun. It's kind of interesting. Uh, a whole lot of different things that don't really involve transport. Uh, we are kind of avoiding the police and all kinds of things. And it looks like we have to avoid a checkpoint right here. Have no vehicles with questionable cargo in the marked area when the time is up. Well, these are all just, that's not questionable cargo, so we're good to go. Don't have to worry about that at all. Let's set up our um, cigar to Fort Myers run. Let's change that and like basically have you can load full if he wants. So we don't have to worry about that. We picked the retirement community. Very good. You've managed to invest your profits in a respectable business. You're clean as a whistle. In the meantime, numerous middlemen were arrested and your client vanished without a trace. Oh no. It might be better to switch to more legitimate activities. A film crew wants to shoot a TV show about the wicked highways and byways of Miami. Your expertise is called for here. Oh. The TV really? series revolves around two laid-back undercover investigators who plow through the morass of vice and crime in Miami dressed in chic sport coats. Thanks to your experience, the spectacular scenes are supposed to end up being particularly realistic. Okay, now what's this escaped? Cleverly engineered. You're just too smart for those block-headed cops and the rest of them. Your boss is very pleased. And that, in turn, is good for your health. Okay. All right. Uh, what's this? In one dramatic chase scene, the team of investigators is supposed to pursue the fugitives in a hovercraft. Make sure that the staging of the appropriate episode is done well. I have two hovercrafts on different lines in the marked areas. At the same time, well, I was just about to, just about to configure this actually to a uh, a passenger at a passenger dock. To this. So, There we go. All right, so now we have a passenger dock, and I was about to do passengers down here anyway. Um. Still have 
we still have some hovercraft sitting up here. Come out on that. And get a couple bus stops. Port Myra's bus. Oh, we already did it. Yay. Five vehicles. Nice. Okay, so we already that did that one. Getting so many action scenes in the can creates an appetite. The TV crew wants to be provided with excellent catering. So, film crew catering. Film food. Let's set this up. And we'll just do a truck stop. Catering and they want fifty. Film crew catering, West Palm Beach. Wait till you're full. Okay. The two TV cops are hot on the trail of a gang of smugglers who are intent on getting their merchandise to a safe place by plane. You're supposed to give a helping hand with the aerial showdown. All right. Well, let's see here. What's this flight? Have a plane fly through the marked area and click on it. Pause. Yep. That worked. sequence is currently being filmed where the team of investigators drives like crazy around the streets of Miami. Make sure there's nothing in the way on the corresponding stretches of road. Where this... Oh, it's over here. Provide, provide roadblocks so no vehicles can find their way onto the marked road. How about that? One little car left. Buddy.
Okay. Another one? Did that one. Oh, QS. According to the script, at this point, the bad guys are supposed to blow up several bridges all at once. Naturally, you've never done anything like that, but you have heard about how it's done. Blow up three bridges in 10 seconds. I just need to give food to the crew. Oh, we should have. There they are. Let's speed things up. Upgrade this guy's road. The TV series is a mega success. Naturally, above all, thanks to your support. All over America, Miami is now viewed as a dangerous place, but incredibly sexy, too. This sinful image draws the rich and beautiful into town in search of thrilling adventures. But lately, Florida has become a very popular destination for other target groups as well. All the signs point to loads of moolah. Lure various target groups with attractive offers. There ought to be something for everyone, for a young, wealthy clientele and for screwballs, and even for perfectly ordinary families. Okay. The Everglades National Park is a perfect destination for families out on a day trip. That is, as long as you keep an eye on the kids and the alligators aren't hungry. The screwballs from Key West have proclaimed their own republic and want to declare war on the United States of America. The reason? U.S. Customs operations on the way to the island are bad for tourism. Help the island's population to draw attention to the not-so-seriously-meant announcement to wage war. Well, I've earned money, but I haven't transported any people. Maybe, maybe all these people were already in transport before uh, the the thing came up. We'll have to see. All right, what is this? Long, stale loaves of bread are supposed to serve the prankster republic as weapons in the war against the Americans. Give a hand to the military buildup by making sure that as many freshly baked loaves as possible stay put in the bakery and get rock hard. Um, food processing plant. So do we... Do we not transport food then? Here we go here. I'm not transporting food to Miami. That should just drop, right? Okay. The rich and beautiful among young folks won't settle for run-of-the-mill spring break parties. Bring them to Miami Beach, 
where glamour and a whiff of notoriety go hand in hand. Well, we're already transporting people. We have to wait for this to fall before we can start shipping food, I guess. Uh, Key West. Key West is a paradise for all kinds of eccentric characters. They like it when things are unconventional. Transport them by streetcar, an extremely unusual means of transportation for the USA in the 1980s. Build a streetcar to Key West and transport 20 people. All right, streetcars. car is like a train right street car a street car Bus lane, tram, track tool. Is that a streetcar or a tram? Bus lane. Whoa. Depot. A place on Key West. Here. that by a car I guess Speed things back up. 20 of 50. Go back. 
bring 30 people from the Spring Break Resort to Miami by bus. Oh, okay, so we need to make a bus route. From Key West to Miami So Seven go ahead and destroy this bumper catering line. This is the last bonus mission. We should probably be close to done, I guess. We got four people by streetcar, two people, two spring breakers, and 33 people. That didn't give us any 42. They weren't families. Well, people, let's go back. That's the transport value of the food. delivered packages technically value is not dropping at all transported spring breakers Let's check out our trams Or other tram at. Other tram.
three people waiting. 42. Yeah, this hasn't dropped at all. are done. Three cars is going to take time. we could thin this out Ram done. Okay. Deliver food. But I mean, it's not going up or down. I don't understand that one at all. Making good money. Packages, cars, packages. I guess no one's asking for packages yet. Understand this. Plus, we have to delete that. Oh, now it's dropped. Six percent. Now will it go up? Lots of folks can expand that line.
Oh, that's it. We did it. But I don't know. I don't understand this. I didn't. Oh, well. That's fine. But let's continue playing for a little bit and see if we can make that value go down. Maybe we'll just, we'll just stop the truck over here. At the dock or something. This is a kind of fun one. I liked it. stop you all the food can do is just sit there and rot I guess got our truck two percent One, I mean, it's dropping. Eight. I never asked for, for goods, for packages. I thought it asked for packages, but never did. Maybe that's if I pick the spring break one. Making goods. Forty. One percent. You've produced there we so go. much stale bread that the Americans definitely. That's how we did it. All right, guys. So that is it. That is the sinful South. I think that's what this thing was called. Hope you're liking the Learn to Play Let's Play Two series. We're doing this kind of reform play. I'm not really cutting and you know cutting out a lot of what I'm doing so you can kind of see and experience exactly what I'm doing in order to get these things done hope you like that I know it makes for some longer videos maybe compared to some other folks that have these missions up there where they're just cut 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 and showing you the highlights I wanted to kind of show you the whole process uh, because that is part of the learning to play process is see how it all comes together so until next time be sure to like, subscribe, and click that notification bell.